So let's go on a deep dive of availability within Cal.com and learn how to set up your availability to your own individual preference. So first of all, we're just gonna click on availability in the sidebar, and then we're gonna see the different availability schedules that we have. So I have working hours and personal. We can go up into the top right and hit new, and then we can type in a name. So let's do test availability. Then we'll click continue. So that's gonna create the new availability schedule for us and set us a default of nine to five. Now we can also enable and disable other days. We may want, you know, until 1 p.m. on a Saturday. Um, and you can, you can customize any individual day. So say the regular times is from nine till six instead. We can set that here, but rather than click it into every single box, we can do copy times two and then Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday and hit apply. That's done it a hell of a lot quicker for us. You can also do, so if you can do nine till 11 in the morning, then you can also add a new time slot from, you know, five till 7.30. Um, and we can also copy this on certain days as well. Um, you can also equally disable any days that you're not working. And furthermore, you can now add date overrides. So they basically add these specific dates in your calendar when your availability changes. So you can go ahead and hit add an override and then let's pick Wednesday. I'm gonna have an override. And on Wednesday, I am completely unavailable. So if we then hit this override, it's then gonna keep that in there until, uh, you know, as it says here, the date override is archived as soon as the date has passed and won't show up anymore. You can also change the time zone of this availability. And what that means is I might have particular availability when I'm in another country, so you can go ahead and, and choose that here. And furthermore, if you ever wonder, you know, why a time doesn't show up in particular, you can always hit launch troubleshooter, and then that's basically going to just run through very much what our logic sees when it determines when you're free.